George Diaz, we're here at your gym, Flash Boxing, Van Nuys, California. December 7th on Showtime, Pauli Malanaji against, against Zab, Zab, Judah. Zab Judah. What do you think of that fight? I think that's an even base fight. I think um, I may have to give the advantage a little bit, just slightly a bit to uh, to Zab, just because I think he has the punching power. They both got, they both got hand speed. They, go, they both got some type of, some, uh, they both got footwork. But the only problem is that the thing is, um, uh, Zap Judah throws punches with authority. It's something that, and the punching power that he cre he has behind those hands. You know, you still gotta give Zap Judah some respect because you know you saw when he fought um Danny Garcia that he backed up Danny Garcia in the later rounds. And I think it's a pretty even um, playing field fight. Strategically, um, I just gotta see who's gonna press the action. Of course, I think um, um, Judah's gonna press the action to really try to hurt um. um Pauly in the, in, the early, in the early going. The winner of this fight, whether it's Pauly or Zap, who do you want to see them win at 47? At I mean, who do you want to see them fight? You know, they, they've already fought a lot of the guys at 40, 47. Um, you, know, uh, you know, they could have a possibility of fought Dev Devin Alexander. You know, that's probably the one of the, he's one of the fighters that's been, I, I think hasn't really been out, out there active and fought the top, the top names. I know he was supposed to fight um, uh, recently Amir Khan, and that didn't happen. You know, actually, they're 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 both good enough to f actually. I think I'm um, um, already fought Amir Khan. Yeah, both of them fought Amir Khan. Amir Khan beat Zab in four or five rounds. You remember? Yes. yes. And then he he fought um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Paulie in New York, and he stopped him in ten, I think, or wow, was so it eleven? So they both know, fought Amir. So okay, so they both been in the ring with Amir. Victor Ortiz. Would that be Victor good Ortiz one? could be a good possibility. Yeah, who um, wins that one? With um, Zab or Pauly? Uh, I, I think I think um, Victor and um, Zab could that be a, a both left-handers? They're, uh, they're both kind of like that's an even even playing field as well. It just um, I'm gonna have to give it a little bit just maybe to um, uh, I don't know. I I, I, th I just think that's a pretty good. Cool, if I could say certain things about Victor that could benefit, he could capitalize on, on Zab Judah, but I see a lot more possibility that Zab Judah may give more, more problems to Victor Ortiz. So, it's a toss of fight. Now, um, if it's uh, Molinaji and, um, and Victor, you know, I'm going to have to give it slightly to Victor just because of the pressure and, and he gets some type of punchy power, but, you know, you can't count Paulie out because, you know, he still has that will and determination to stay in the fight and he doesn't quit at, in, any, in any situation you receive when he fought Amir, um, I mean, Gokoto, man, oh, broken overall bone, you know, broken jaw, he still kept on coming, trying to fight back. So it's, those are pretty, those are pretty good fight for either either guy to face if it's against each other with against each other or either guy fighting Victor Ortiz. It's a good fight. I think it's still is a fight that will intrigue people to see them fight. There you have it, George Diaz. Stay tuned. Facebook reporting.com and Melly Secback reporting. And you can follow me on Twitter at Secback.